Now, the municipal chief executive of the La Dade Kotopon Municipal Assembly, Reverend Solomon Kote, says he will engage the La Traditional Council to settle the dispute over the takeover of land by private developer. The decision comes on the back of a demonstration on Tuesday by the youth against the La Traditional Council and some government officials for their involvement in the sale of the supposed lands. Youth marched to the MCE's office to ask him to intervene in the alleged sale of the lands by the traditional council. They alleged the involvement of some government officials in taking over the lands. It is the stool land. It must be left under the stool. We are told that government takes 40% of the release and shares the rest to Lame and other people who are involved. And we say the government has no business taking anything. We are prepared to wait till the due time for the entire La Aviation land to be released to the La people. Our last resort is to go to court, file a criminal and a civil issue, uh, suit. If it is not altered, we are, we are, we are sure about it. We are not afraid of the officers. We are prepared to protect this land. This is the only place we have for our community and social events. This is where we were born and bred. They have sold all the land and we say we will fight to protect it. The La Dade Kotopon Municipal Chief Executive, Reverend Solomon Kote Nikwe, said the assembly will soon meet the traditional council to settle the matter. Oh, they can give government a week to rectify the issue. It's not about the government. That land in question Bailey is a two land. So we he because they brought the petition. We have a very cordial relationship with the traditional council. So we'll sit down with them and then we'll look into the issues and we we'll invite the concerned uh, La Youth.